Quality Check Interlocking Bricks CACB Construction How to check the quality and safety of an interlocking brick house in load-bearing wall design. To build earthquake resistant, you must strictly Use high quality OPC cement Use CACB bricks of high quality, 3.5 MPA or higher Use masons who are trained and skilled in CACB masonry Strictly follow the approved house drawings and construction guidelines. Location of house Minimum 5 feet from a wall or an edge Avoid building nearby filled or loose soil, landslide prone areas, cracks or river banks. Foundation Minimum 3 feet deep and 2.5 feet wide. Use flat stones. Use cement sand mortar. Three vertical bars in each corner, four in T junction and five in plus junctions should be anchored from foundation of specified diameter. Use proper L-bend to anchor the vertical rebar. The length of L-bend should be 60 times the diameter of the rebar. DPC beam should be minimum 100 mm thick and 350 mm wide. Additional vertical rebar shall be placed at every door and window opening and at every 1.2 to 1.5 meter of continuous wall anchored from DPC band. CACB wall All corners should be 90 degrees. A thick layer of mortar, minimum 10 mm, is placed below first layer of CACB to ensure bricks are laid in level. Wet the CACB before brick laying so that mortar bonds properly. A thin layer of mortar between each course of bricks, 5 mm. After every fourth course of bricks, fill all vertical holes with mortar and compact the mortar. Water level pipe and spirit are used to make sure bricks are leveled. T and plus junctions, make sure to interlock alternately each course of bricks by using three-quarter bricks. Sill band and lintel band minimum 75 mm thick. Water the wall for 28 days to cure the mortar and bands. Walls are tied together using vertical rebar and horizontal bands to ensure stability of the house. Roof Proper connection between top band and roof truss the truss or rafter should be anchored with the top band. Sufficient overhang of roof to avoid rainwater hitting the wall. Please note that this video is only showing some of the key steps in construction. Always strictly follow the government approved drawings and construction guidelines.